Hey everyone, Brass Monkey here, and in this video I'll be showing you how to unlock the Calibri. The Calibri is a micro pistol in Battlefield 1. It looks like an Easter egg, but it is an actual pistol that was manufactured in the early 1900s. The word Calibri is German for hummingbird, and the pistol was designed by a former watchmaker, which explains why it is so small. To unlock the Calibri, you first need to reach level 10 in the Scout class, then it can be purchased for a mere 150 war bonds. The Calibri is definitely more for fun than use as a practical sidearm, as it deals very little damage. At extremely close range, the Calibri deals modest damage, but after a few meters it quickly drops off and can deal as little as only one damage per shot at medium and longer distances. If you want to try and get kills with the Calibri, I have a few tips for you. I first tried sneaking up on players who were stationary and using guns like the AA or the artillery. But because the Calibri takes multiple full magazines to get a kill, enemies had enough time to jump off the gun and fire back. Next, I tried injuring the player with my primary rifle first, then switching to the Calibri. I got close with this method a few times, but the enemy was usually killed by a teammate before the Calibri could do the job. Lastly, I equipped incendiary trip mines and waited for an enemy to trigger them. This took a few tries, but I finally managed to get a kill this way. If you were going for Calibri kills, this would be my recommendation, as the flames from the incendiary mine make it very hard for your enemy to see you. If you've already unlocked the Calibri or have some ideas of your own, share your tips for getting kills with this fun weapon in the comments section below. If you're interested in all of the best Battlefield 1 strategies, in-depth weapon statistics like damage, time to kill, recoil charts, and more, then you may want to check out the Ultimate Utility app for your smartphone. I've placed a download link in the description below. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.